This is how we add a delivery to a tank. We go to the Sites tab and we select the site that we want to add the delivery to. We go through to the Auto Dip Schedule which allows us to add the delivery from the tab. We select the tank if there's more than one tank. We select the date and the time of the delivery, the volume that's the amount of fuel that was delivered and the purchase order or any other comments you may have and save that. Once you've done that, if there has been a change in price, you can go back to the company homepage and select the sites drop down and add a site price. If you haven't done this before, you'll have to do this for the first time and you can add the product that was delivered, the price on the day, the price type, you can then add the date and the currency and save it. So each time you come and add a price, it'll update it from the date you add in the site price tab. So you're getting constant updates on price. These prices will also reflect back in your transaction reporting. So if we go back through to company page and we go into transactions, um, from the dates that you add those prices, it'll display in this column down here, in the price, and the total price down here. That is how you add prices.